coming next. Yeah, I mean, it, Mother Nature just surprises you every time, yeah. and you just got to be ready for it. I mean, it's a beautiful scene, though. I mean, dangerous but beautiful, of course. But things are improving in our neck of the woods, eastern Long Island, the last bit to get those showers. Southwestern Connecticut, too, along the I-95 corridor. I'd say probably maybe just at around Bridgeport and Points North, you'll notice some possible downpours or at least light rain parts of the Hudson Valley northern uh, I'd say northern uh, Nassau County and the eastern Long Island Suffolk County along the LIE let's zoom in and take a closer look Sound Beach down and toward Smithtown and just points east of there and south as well in Islip and Brookhaven but if you are heading west beyond that point roads are much drier especially if you're traveling you know along the northern state or uh, the LIE northern part of or North Shore of Long Island, a few sh scattered showers in Nassau, Eastern Tip as well, the Twin Forks, uh, right around Springs and Ditch Plains. We'll take a closer look at uh, that wider view and look how it's dissipating. And that's because that high pressure is coming into play and that's helping to dry things out. Remember what we talk about with high pressure? It's kind of acting as sort of like a barrier. Just think of a bodyguard just keeping things out, right? That's the high. It's keeping all this wet weather away. So once that low continues to move out, high will replace it and the winds will pick up a little bit. So you give or take the seven o'clock hour. That's the hour of transition where things will really start to dry out. So by nine o'clock eastern end of Long Island, the last bit to get it and points west already dry. Getting breezy at times with those winds out of the north and a look at your temperature readings right now. We're in the 50s and around 60 in some locations. We went up a degree in Brookhaven. Upper 60s, low 70s, jumping right over to that seven day forecast. A dry weekend ahead. And we're going to send things over to Julie. Anything new going on there?